Coach, just tell us a little bit about what you like uh, in this, this class that you just signed. Well, I think every class, you know, that you're, you're trying to accomplish some type of goal, um, we usually try to put them in groups of two, two years at a time. So when you're looking at the 13 group this year and the 14 group next year, you're trying to, you're trying to weigh out how much pitching you want in one group and how much uh, athleticism you want in a group. And that's kind of what we did with this 13th class is we got some, some real good athletes, some people that can play more than one position. And I think that that was vital for us. From a pitching standpoint, you know, we're going to see huge losses this year with the draft and with graduation, and therefore we felt like we needed to be um, solid in the pitching, and we really feel like we had a great uh, run at pitching. We think we got some of the best pitchers on the West Coast, and, um, and so when you combine those two things, obviously we feel great about our, our class, and um, you know, I think that the main thing is that we got the people that we want. We got the people that fit into what we're doing and not necessarily get caught up in the hype of... Uh, maybe going out and getting a guy that's going to be a first round draft pick so it makes our recruiting class look like it's much better than it's going to be. We got kids that we really feel like are going to be not only great uh, student athletes here, but eventually they're going to be pro professional athletes and, 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 and we're excited about that. But we're really excited about the athleticism we have in the class. Even the pitchers, most of the pitchers we have are kids that play another sport, uh, you know, or play another position when they're playing on their baseball team. So I think we've got real good athletes in this class. You mentioned that you went out and got players who fit kind of how Oregon State does things, and how are some of those ways? Well, I think we're looking for a guy that, first of all, wants to come here and, and, and experience the growth that you experience when you get a chance to be a, a college athlete, experience uh, that time of your life of going to school, getting an education, developing mentally and physically, um, and then preparing yourself for a professional career. We are, we are advocates of professional baseball. We just want to be part of that. We want to make sure kids are prepared for that. I think we do as good a job, if not the best job, of anybody in the country in taking a young man out of high school and developing him towards a, a career uh, in professional baseball and also preparing them to be a, um, a, a productive citizen out there with a degree, what they're going to do socially, and, and, and I think it's a great experience. And I think that uh, for us, we look for kids that have an interest. If we talk to somebody and they said, I really like to be a, uh, I really like to go to school, but if I go in the, if I go in the fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth round, then, um, you know, I'm going to sign, you know, hey, good luck. And, and maybe that's not exactly, you know, uh, where we're sitting. So uh, we, we, we like our guys. We think we've got a great group of guys. We think they blend well. Um, with the class that, you know, the 14 class that will be next year and also the returners. But we're going to have great losses this year with the draft, and therefore we needed to replace those guys. One last one. When one of these young men tells you that he wants to attend Oregon State, what's that feeling like for you and your staff? Oh, it's, it's great because there's a lot of work that's put into it, and every guy that we recruit has an opportunity to go to other schools, and, and uh, most of the time, almost all the time, it's in one or two or more or all the schools in our conference. So we're competing, we think, for the best athletes on the West Coast, the best athletes um, in the country. Uh, but we, we really, really believe that those guys could go anywhere they wanted in the country, and therefore it feels it's, it's obviously a, a, a high. You know, it's, it's uh, very similar to winning that game with uh, punching out the guy in the ninth, you know, with a one run lead. You know, you just, that hard work pays off. So we put a lot of effort at this. Our coaching staff, Coach Bailey, Coach Yeski, Coach Jenkins, our entire uh, athletic department, um, Paul Yeager in academics, um, Hank Hager is our SID, uh, Jeff Taylor in video, um, we got our trainer, you know, Josh Therian, we got our doctors, Dr. Ackerman, Dr. Vela, Dr. Graham. I mean, it's a, col a collaborated effort of a lot of people, as you well know, um, that help student athletes. And so for us here at Oregon State, uh, being in the, in the greatest college town in the country, uh, it, it's, a, it's an unbelievable feeling to know that a young man wants to come here and, and take that very, very important step in his life to develop into what he's going to do um, after college. All right, Coach, thanks for your time, and congratulations on a great signing class. Thank you, guys.